the blind justice. In the bustling city of New Orleans, a place where jazz echoed through the streets and spicy aromas filled the air, lived Thomas Wolfe, a dedicated and talented young lawyer. Thomas had a deep admiration for the law and believed in the principle of justice is blind. He took this notion to heart as he tirelessly fought for the rights of the innocent and sought to unveil the truth, regardless of social status or appearance. One fateful day, Thomas received a case that would challenge his belief in blind justice. A high-profile businessman named Richard Hartley was accused of embezzlement, a crime that could tarnish his reputation and destroy his empire. Richard was known for his charisma and generosity, making it hard for Thomas to believe he was capable of such wrongdoing. As Thomas delved into the case, he unearthed a complex web of financial transactions and hidden accounts. The evidence seemed overwhelming, pointing towards Richard's guilt. However, Thomas couldn't ignore his gut feeling that there was more to the story than met the eye. He spent sleepless nights poring over documents, questioning witnesses, and re-examining the evidence. With each piece of information, he began to piece together a different narrative. Thomas discovered that Richard's company had been targeted by a rival competitor who had manipulated the financial records to frame him. With renewed determination, Thomas presented his findings in court. He laid out the intricate details of the manipulation, connecting the dots and revealing the true perpetrator behind the embezzlement scheme. Courtroom was captivated by his impassioned defense, and even the judge seemed impressed by the depth of his investigation. As the trial progressed, the truth emerged, and Richard's name was cleared. The real culprits were apprehended, and justice prevailed. Thomas had proven that justice wasn't just blind. It was a meticulous, tireless searcher for the truth, unswayed by appearances or influence. The victory was bittersweet for Thomas. While he had upheld his belief in blind justice, he had also come to realize that sometimes the pursuit of truth required a level of discernment beyond simple impartiality. His journey through this case had taught him that justice might be blind, but those who sought it should possess both insight and unwavering dedication. From that day on, Thomas Wolfe continued to champion the cause of justice, understanding that while the scales of justice might be blind, it was the duty of those who wielded them to ensure they were tipped in the right direction. And as he walked, the streets of New Orleans the jazz still echoing in the background, he carried with him the lessons of his most challenging case, a testament to the fact that even blind justice could see through the darkness to find the truth.